today is an incredibly rainy day. Um, it literally thunderstormed last night. It's rainy today. It's a very cosy day and I'm so here for it. I love a rainy day when I'm out, like inside. When I'm out, no, I'm not a fan. But when I'm not going anywhere and I'm at home, I'm always like so here for a rainy day. And especially recently where it's been so hot and sticky, it's nice just to have a rainy day. Um, I'm very happy for it. Happy for it? Excited for it. Happy about it. <laughs> anyway, today I have an Ikea delivery coming. It's actually coming this morning. Should hopefully be here within the next, I'm guessing half an hour, roughly. Um, I'm very excited. I ordered some new bits for my flat. Basically, I didn't really need to be buying all of this stuff at once, but Ikea delivery is not cheap. And I thought if I'm gonna do it, I'm just gonna do it all in one go because otherwise you end up spending 40 pounds so the delivery is £40 this time. Then if I wanted to order something in a few months time, that's another £40. So I just thought, I'm ordering it all at once. Um, so I ordered a new desk. I've got some chest of drawers coming, some shelves for my Billy bookcase, um, some curtain poles, and I've got, also got a lamp. So I'm very excited. They're not like super exciting, but they're things that I really need. I don't really need a new desk, but I bought a new desk. <laughs> I really want to like make my flat feel really like streamlined and clean and nice um, because I spend a lot of time here and I want it to look nice and I want it to feel good and not feel messy and sometimes I find that like my desk right now it has no drawers nothing so I feel like it constantly looks messy whereas the desk I've brought has a drawer where I can put things in so yeah and my chest of drawers is because my wardrobe <laughs> it's rather full and we're not even hitting autumn winter yet and that's when my wardrobe is really full so i've taken it upon myself to finally get like a chest of drawers for that room um but yeah i'm kind of just waiting for that to arrive um i always have this like anxiety because like where i live um there's no lift in my block of flats i live on the fourth floor there's not much to go up but I always get nervous because sometimes people get a bit like aggy that they have to carry stuff up the stairs. Um, and I had a mirror delivered, that mirror right there, the other week. And the guy was like, you're going to have to help me carry it then. And I was a bit like, I mean, like, you're a delivery, like, okay, I did. But you know, just like, you should state whether something's got stairs or not. Like, it's not my problem if there's not a lift. But anyway, like, I always think to myself, like, I'm in quite a good position. Like, the stairs for my block of flats, they're quite wide. There's a lot of space. Some of the flats I've been to and visited, the stairs are, like, they still have to carry it up there. There's no lift in those. So, anyway, I'm rambling. But I will catch you when the IKEA delivery is here. <laughs> You'll be pleased to know that the parcels have arrived. My IKEA delivery is here. Ta da You can't really see it. There we go. There it is. Um, but from watching the men bring the stuff into my flat, I realised that I've ordered the wrong shelves for my Billy bookcase. They are not the shelves for a Billy bookcase. I don't know what they are. They are not what I ordered. Or I ordered the wrong thing. I don't know. Um, <laughs> good one. To be fair to myself and to IKEA, I didn't properly check what they were I just put them in my um basket and hope for the best so that could be on me it probably is on me um but I don't know how you're supposed to return things to Ikea when you don't have a car or live anywhere near an Ikea do you know what I mean so we'll see about that one um but I'm just sitting down to do a little bit of work um I've got a couple of emails to answer this morning um which i was waiting until my ikea delivery came to start because i hate sitting down and doing something and then getting disrupt disrupted disrupt distracted both of those words um so now it's arrived i can do this and then we can get building together because it's the perfect day to build flat pack for flat pack why can't i speak flat pack furniture so i'll catch you when we start building 
Okay, I've had a change of plan. I've decided that I'm gonna just build the furniture because I'm just sat there on my laptop, like attempting to do stuff that I don't want to do when all I wanna do is build the furniture. So, we're gonna build furniture. But, in order for me to build said furniture, I need to move this array of mess that I have created because this is where the chest of drawers is going and I'm gonna start with the chest of drawers because it's gonna be the lengthiest thing and it's the thing that will make the most benefit when once being built. Does that make sense? So that's what we're gonna start with. Oh. Why am I like this? Will I pick up the clothes and hang them up? No. Will I just dump them in a pile over here? Absolutely. Absolutely. Of course I will. I love being an independent woman, right? But this, my muscles can't handle. Show me what, maybe we should just lay this one on the floor. Ah! Ow, oh. Right, did it. Right, the first bits are out. The base of the chest of drawers bits. I think this is gonna take me a long time. So buckle up, hope you're ready. Oh, I've got a message. I think what I'm gonna do is bring in my computer into here and have it on and watch something whilst I do this. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do it otherwise. So let's do this. Let the building commence. I'm really hot. <laughs> The main base of the shelves, no, they're not shelves, the drawers <laughs> are up, is up. Can't speak, don't know what's wrong with me, but I kind of, I'm, I'm vibing it, I'm vibing it. This is the kind of situation we're going for. Obviously it will have drawers, gonna make it look all pretty. Let's see what it looks like from the angle of my bed. This is the vision. Basically the thought is so that the bed is gonna sit in the middle of this, this is gonna be in line with the bed. And then this area over here is where the rail's gonna go. But this is also gonna be the area where I film like reels and stuff. So I need it to be like a bare space that I can move stuff out of. So this has to be more over this way. Especially once it's got things in it, I won't be able to move it. So yeah, I like it so far. I'm now building the um, drawers. I'm watching Selling the OC. Building the drawers, there's six drawers to build, so I'm just gonna be sat here for a bit, building them. Um, and I'll show you the final result once it's all in, but it looks pretty good so far. I'm quite chuffed that nothing's gone wrong so far. Touch wood, I don't even know if that's wood, wood. <laughs> Hello, we're doing the, I, I keep wanting to say shelves, but they're not shelves, they're drawers. Um, I've already done one right there. I'm um, doing two at once and then I'm going to go onto those ones because they have a different packet of bits and bobs. I've only gone and done it. She's up. She looks very bare. Let's put something on her. I have these frames which I've just had like balanced on the floor. Um, there's going to be, I don't think the white, I think there's too much white here. I think we need a bit of wood but how cute. 
how cute it's taken me ages to do that i'm now gonna have to go and do some work because it's taken me so much longer than i thought my back hurts from like crouching over um but i am gonna unbox the lamp that i got because i'm gonna film a little tiktok of me unboxing it and i'm gonna unbox it on here i think i love this i think this is gonna be so useful for the rest of my clothes and stuff that Basically, I want to move some of my like folded clothes into here so I can use the space better in my wardrobe. That's the idea anyway. Um, but yeah, I love it. I love it. Okay, I've left all the chaos behind in the bedroom. I'm going to deal with that later. And we're going to build the desk because I'm just, I'm just dying to do it. I can't leave it in the box any longer. Um, this is my current desk situation. Obviously, I usually have my computer on there, but I had it in the other room so I could watch something um, whilst I built. Um, this desk I've had for years. I actually got this in Amsterdam and then I spray painted it white because I didn't like it because it was black. Now I just don't really love it. I just don't feel like it really gives the vibe of what I want in this room nor the vibe of... Basically, I want my desk to look super clean like it doesn't really look like a desk. Um, this chair probably won't go with the new desk that I have but... I actually like, this chair is like the vibe of my flat anyway and the black ties in with everything else. So basically, the new desk is going to go here and I'm going to try and take this one apart. If I can't take this one apart, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. But, regardless, this is where the new desk is going and I'm probably going to build it right here. Um, and then I think this new lamp, which I didn't show you, I just filmed a TikTok. This is also from Ikea. I will link all of these bits and bobs below, but this lamp, I want to sit on my desk because when it gets like cold and dark in the evenings and I need a lamp on that is what I want to put on there so let's build I've got my uh, good old trusty um, what do you call this what do you call this I really want to say spatula but that's not the right word screwdriver that's the one um, to help me build it so let's go god this was the most stressful thing the draw i did it wrong at one point and these edge bits were on the wrong way around but they're now in the right place so we can move all this and pop it into place <laughs> funny but this is a massive upgrade look how nice this looks I feel like this looks like a proper professional desk situation that did not I am obsessed I don't know if my lamp looks good there but maybe I need like some other bits and bobs next to it um it could go on the other side to be fair doesn't need to sit there but anyway I love it I put my computer in place um, the chair doesn't overly go with this situation, but I'm not mad about it, so we're going to roll with it. Chair is not important right now to get a new one. Do not need that. But I love this. It fits so much better in the space. There's obviously this small gap, which I don't think is too bad. So, yay, I love it. 